Learn from God to enlighten your soul. This is your daily devotional reading. Our Father cares, January 10th. The renewed heart loves as Christ loved. A new commitment I will give unto you, that ye love one another as I have loved you, that ye also love one another. John 13 verse 34 Jesus says, Love one another as I have loved you. Love is not simply an impulse. Love is not simply an impulse, a transitory emotion dependent upon circumstances. It is a living principle, a permanent power. The soul is fed by the streams of pure love that flow from the heart of Christ as a wellspring that never fails. Oh, how is the heart quickened? How are its motives ennobled, its affections deepened by this communion? Under the education and disciple of the Holy Spirit, the children of God love one another truly, sincerely, unaffectedly, without partiality and without hypocrisy, and this because the heart is in love with Jesus. Our affection for one another springs from our common relation to God. We are one family. We love one another as He loved us. When compared with this true, sanctified, disciplined affection, the shallow courtesy of this world, the meaningless expression of effusive friendships, are as chaff to the wheat. To love as Christ loved means to manifest unselfishness at all times and in all places by kind words and pleasant looks. Genuine love is a precious attribute of heavenly origin which increases its fragrance in proportion as it is dispensed to others. Christ's love is deep and earnest flowing like an irrepressible stream to all who will accept it. There is no selfishness in his love. If this heaven-born love is an abiding principle in the heart, it will make itself known not only to those we hold most dear in sacred relationship, but to all with whom we come in contact. It will lead us to bestow little acts of attention to make concessions, to perform deeds of kindness, to speak tender, true, encouraging words. It will lead us to sympathize with those whose hearts hunger for sympathy. Our Father cares, January 10th.